hi guys welcome back to my channel it's to missing here again welcome to my channel to all my return subscribers thank you for always coming back to see my video and to all my new subscribers thank you very much for subscribing to my videos to my channel thank you so much and if you're seeing my face for the very first time it's your girl to missing my name is to missing i'm a very good girl and you are going to enjoy it here. if you like the kind of content i put out here it's the subscribe button comment like and share thank you very much so guys without wasting much of our time like i usually say let's just dive into it if you are camera shy please watch this video to the end to the very end watch this video to the very end it's very short i'll be done in no minutes if you are the kind of person that you don't like standing in front of a camera and you're especially business owners online business owner you need to be at the front of the camera you need to show your face there's some business that is, is faceless like they don't show their face they only show their hands and show their roots it's fine but sometimes if you are doing it like that it might work for a it might not work for b you understand what i'm trying to say somebody is selling their goods they're not showing their face and they're making sales you might try it and you will not make sales and at the same time some people need to see your face Honestly, 80% of people need to see your face so that they can buy from you. These people don't know you. They just want to buy online. They just want to pay, give you, pay you. And it's with faith. Anybody that buy goods online, they are buying with faith that, okay, oh, this person is going to deliver my goods and this person is not going to scam me. You understand that kind of a thing. So for you to at least boost their faith more, you, I think you really need to face the camera. My sister, Aunt Shade, I need to face the camera. You need to face the camera. You might try faceless brand, it can work for you. And at the same time, it might not work for you. Even some faceless brand that I know, that they do not show their face, they have influencers that influenced for them. They have people that they will be like, okay, we are the face of the brand, buy from them. If anything happen, all those responsible. You get what I'm trying to say? Even some faceless brands, they have people that they will come, even if the owner of the business did not want to show their face or anything. There are people that they will use to advertise their goods. You that you cannot pay for influencer yet. You need to show your face. Even before you know it, there are some skills in you. Probably you can't you didn't know that you can talk, you can shout, you can do anything. Even if it's to come calmly and do it. Try one after the other, you will get it. So this is a trick that I'm going to give you. Don't shoot video with your front camera. Shoot with your back camera. When you are shooting, look for a mirror. Place it in front. Just place a mirror at the front of your tripod stand. You get what I'm trying to say? Place a big mirror. I am going to show you how I'm making this video. I will show you how I'm making this video. I see the practical of what I am saying. Get a big mirror. Let the mirror be in front of you. So you'll be seeing yourself through. You'll be seeing yourself through like the mirror. Just as I am, as I'm making this video, I'm using my back camera and I have a big mirror. Not because I'm shy or anything. I just want to look at my angles, at these angles, right? You get what I'm trying to see? That is just what I want to check. That's why I have a mirror at my, at my front. And because I want to make this video, so it's not as if I'm shy. I'm not camera shy. To God be the glory. <laughs> you get what I'm trying to say? So you'll be seeing yourself. And even if you know you do not want to see yourself, don't get any mirror. Just use your back camera. Sit at first try the video or you stand at first try the video check just do like one minute first time what's which one minute seconds do like three seconds first time go to the back of the video check to see that your angle okay i'm showing don't touch it am i showing I'm, okay i'm showing then come back press play and make the original video so when you are not seeing yourself it is when you are seeing yourself you realize that ah show what that by my neck show what that by my back ah, my 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 face is not fine my my this thing is not fine and if you are not confident of your face use your snapchat filter yes it's allowed yes i'm telling you use your snapchat filter but you can just just there's a filter now that looks like natural filter they are even so natural like so natural that's the kind of filter i'm using now they are so natural i only use all those beautiful ones once in a while actually this one that has abdraman or something i only use ones in a while i use the natural filter now the one that will just show my color just the way it is to just enhance me a little you can use that one and if you do not want to use in uh, that one you can use the beautiful beautiful snapchat filter 
It is when you are seeing your face, like looking into your face, you are like, ah, hey, she by Try it. Like, um, I don't want to say push. I'm encouraging you to try to use your back camera to shoot a video. When you shoot it finish, before you when you start at first, you will when you're talking, when you're feeling, you know you are just facing the camera, so you are not seeing anything. That is if you are not checking yourself through the mirror. You are not facing anything. You get what I'm trying to say. So you are just talking to yourself alone in and to the back camera, you're not seeing your face. Before you know it, you're already flowing, you're already talking, you're already advertising your goods. Hello, my people, this is my bag. You see this beautiful bag? You can take it to church, you can take it to the market, you can do this. You understand? You see this pink color of bag for your kids? It's very good. You know, children love, and um, baby girls love pink. If you don't buy these goods, um, this bag, it will pain you. Oh, you snooze, you lose. You understand that kind of a thing? You make all the videos, you do all of your freestyles, and before you know it, you will conquer it. That's a trick I tell people. Use your back camera to shoot. If you know you are shy of the camera, don't look at yourself. Don't see anything. Then when you finish, pick it up. Just try and do one or two editing. And don't seek validation from anybody. I mean any soul. Don't seek validation from anybody. See, everybody is out on social media to do their thing. The people that are criticizing you, the people that are criticizing you, maybe they are sleeping in one room and you, you are on your bed, you are enjoying some of them have not even eaten. Maybe it's only 100 naira recharge card that they are using to, to make that video. 100 naira recharge card. Maybe it's the one that they are using to make that video to type no rubbish comments. So is it that one that you not care about? Don't seek validation from anybody. And please, don't send to your friends to ask them that is he okay? Because let me tell you, you won't walk back. They will not encourage you. Friends will not encourage you when it comes to that. It only takes the grace of God. You're a very good friend to encourage you. The first thing they, they are going to say is to condemn. So if you continue to care about what people will say, they will say it's not fine, it's not this, it's not that. My dear, as a business owner, you need it. Same thing with anybody that wants to start creating content. Just start and do your thing. Don't seek validation from anybody. You are an adult. So far you are 18 and you know what is right from what is wrong. I'm not saying you should not listen to people. You can listen to your parents, you can listen to your godfathers, your godmothers, your pastors or anything, or even anybody close to you say, oh, um, do it this way, do it this way. And there's something they think that these English people call constructive criticism. Some people that when they criticize you, they will, it will be like, at least they will, it will be reasonable. You yourself will sit down and say, oh, she's making a lot of sense. You get what I'm trying to say? She's making a lot of sense. So don't care about what people have to say. Just come out and do your thing. Give it a try. That's just it. And if you are shy of the camera, start with your back um, camera. So just like I said, that was where I was sitting down to make the video. And this is my tripod stand. As you can see, this is a spare room. This is another room in my house. This is my phone that I'm using to make the video. This is the camera. I'm using the back camera. So this is the mirror in front of it. So when I sit down to make video, I don't know if you understand what I'm saying. When I sit down to make video, I can see myself. You can. I don't know if you are seeing that small, that small camera. Can you see that camera? Can you see? I'm seeing myself. The, the, this part. I think I'm going to look for something to highlight it when editing this video. Can you see that that part? I can see myself. So you just be looking at your, looking at yourself in the mirror. You get what I'm trying to say? Whereas you are shooting with your back camera this is another trick to shoot with back camera because back camera has a clearer view so i'm even teaching you two three things at a time teaching you how you can overcome in camera shyness and at the same time how to shoot with your back camera to give you a very good um this thing just get that mirror can you see i have it so this is it can you see what i'm saying so that is it and if you know that that camera will still be and um, that mirror will still be stopping you please don't use the mirror <laughs> Don't bother, don't use the mirror, don't see anything. Just sit down, make your videos and all of that. You get what I'm trying to say. So that will be all for now. I hope you've learned one of two things. Please, if you learned one of two things in this video, please let us know in the comment section. And uh, please, uh, please subscribe to my YouTube channel. Get us to 1,000 subscribers. Please, don't just come and be checking us and go. Please hit the subscribe button, comment, like and share if you like this video. My name is Tommy Simmons again. And is there, if there's anything you can add to what you want to add to what I've said, please let us know in the comment section. I will really, really appreciate that. Thank you. See you guys later. And bye for now.